Hey guys, and welcome to a new series on this channel from a game series that we have not touched yet on this channel, but it is one of my lifetime favorites. Today we are going to be playing The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. I had talked a little bit about this on Twitter and during the stream. It's just something I really wanted to do. I figure it fits the theme of this channel, so why not? I have a capture card. I can record it. We are playing the HD version. I was going to play the original one because I feel like it runs a little bit better, but my GameCube was being, it was being weird. It's been having issues lately, so we're just gonna play it on the Wii U. I need to play it more often anyways, but just the music of this is making me emotional. Let's go ahead and get into this. <laughs> like, I uh, might actually cry. Uh, yes, I'm, I'm playing on the gamepad. I kind of wish I had a Wii U Pro Controller, but it's fine. Gamepad works. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, I have made some saves. Me, my brother, and Ryder probably too. <laughs> Which one do I get rid of? We'll just do the first one. It doesn't really matter. I haven't played on this since 2015. I don't know if I'm going to show the little intro thing, just because I know that Nintendo's, like, not strict anymore about uploading gameplay, but I'm still a little bit worried about just having the music playing and whatnot, so I do think I'm gonna skip through the intro. It's wonderful. It has a lovely song. I'd recommend, like, searching for it elsewhere, but we will skip past that. Should I be basic? Should I just be Lonk again? I deleted Lonk. Is that a dead meme? I'm just gonna be basic. We're just gonna be Link. <laughs> no need to get all weird. All right, be right back. I'm gonna just uh, go cry. <laughs> I'm so excited. Cause this, this, I, I really enjoy Breath of the Wild. I don't think it's my favorite though. I think this one is. It just holds a special place in my heart. It's nostalgic. I love it. Not to mention it has one of my favorite characters in it, but we'll get to that later. I'm actually going to cry. Oh no. Oh, stupid eyes. I love this game. Okay, are we done here? <laughs> I'm so excited. I love this game so much, you guys. And I don't think I have played it since like 2015. I'm not crying, you're crying. Oh. And the seagulls. I love the seagulls. Right, I should probably be reading this game. This or the subtitles. This is a game that needs some reading. <laughs> Big brother! <laughs> oh. See, like, I do like the the HD remake. Like, they did good with it. I don't feel like it was necessary, but my GameCube's dying, so... <sighs> Who doesn't just pass out on this giant tower? Like, why not? <laughs> I'm so excited. I knew you'd be here. <laughs> the face. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is my favorite spot to gaze out at the sea. When I play with the gulls, I call it Errol's Lookout. So, do you remember what day it is today? <laughs> You're still half asleep, aren't you? Did you forget? Did I just sleep out here? <laughs> Big brother, it's your birthday. That's why Grandma has been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. <laughs> oh man. It's a good thing I came to find you. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants, don't you think? Probably. Okay. okay. All right, there we go. I was like, ah, how long is she just gonna sit here and stare at me? Now I gotta get used to the controls again. Don't mind me. Let's go down the ladder or back up the ladder. <laughs> Yeah, just- just let go. It's fine. We'll be alright. You guys... I just- I just love Zelda games, okay? I know I don't talk about it too much because, like, it's majority Elder Scrolls channel, but, you know, we could use some variety up in here. Let's get these rupees. Yes, please. Thank you. Alright. Not so hard. Now, we should be able to make it back just by swimming. We can't swim that far, really. So much nostalgia, you guys! I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to handle it. Oh no. I forgot! Oh, I hate that kid! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! Alright. 
He's staying in place. We're all good here. Let's go talk to Grandma. <sighs> in the cute little house. Help, it's- the first, like, at least five episodes of this are, um, all just going to be me, uh, crying. So, uh, hi. What can you do? I'm just- I'm just being on brand, okay? Here we are. <laughs> I've been waiting for you, Link. Hi. Link. Try these on. That was a little awkward, but okay. I will. Time certainly flies. I can't believe you're already old enough to wear these clothes. He looks thrilled. You got the hero's clothes. They might be a little warm for this weather. <laughs> Just a tad. I don't know how it is. It's about a million degrees in here. I look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on. Today is a day to celebrate. It is the day that you become the same age as the young hero spoken of in all the legends. You only have to wear them for one day, so don't look so down. Be proud, child. <laughs> He's so sad. In the olden days, this was the day boys were finally considered to be men. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. Great! But we don't live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the ways of peace. <laughs> Not for long. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about swordplay. Hanging the family shield on the wall as a decoration is another tradition that has been carried down from those days. <laughs> Looks great. Does all this make sense to you? I guess. <laughs> d d does it matter? Isn't that nice, Link? They suit you perfectly. A perfect fit. Well, tonight I'm going to invite the whole town over for your birthday party. So I better start getting ready, shouldn't I? Your grandma is going to make your favorite soup for you tonight. Mmm. I just know you're looking forward to it. <laughs> you seem so thrilled about the clothes. Now go get your sister, Errol. Alright. Right then, let's go get Errol. I guess we could... We could mess around a little bit, you know? Uh, get, get some piggies. That's that's how to crouch. There we go. Hello. You don't see anything, even though I'm right here. Now, do I want to do this? Poor pigs. I remember what happens. You can't fool me, game. What do you want, old man? I'm holding the pig. Leave me alone. You're gonna talk to me. Yeah, you made me drop the pig. Hoi, Link. Press the ZL right there and use A to talk to me. Try it. Way to break the immersion guy, but sure. Hello. That's correct. You're a smart one. You, my friend, have just targeted me. You see, when you press ZL, you can target certain objects. I, for one, use it quite often to talk to folks who are far away from me. Great. Of course, even if there isn't anything around you to target, you can press ZL to face forward, you know? It's quite handy indeed. Yeah, I bet. There are a myriad of other ways to use targeting as well. Quite an ingenious little thing, if I do say so myself. Of course, that's not the only trick in my bag. Not remotely. I could teach you a few more things if you'll just climb up that ladder over there and drop by my room. I think I got it. I think I got it. Like, I don't remember the controls entirely. Give me my pig back, no! Come back, little piggy. Little piggy, I should probably crouch after you, huh? Do I want the rupees? I guess, I guess, just for those of you that haven't experienced this game in its entirety, which a lot of you guys acted like you hadn't whenever I was streaming, or not a lot, but at least a good amount of people. All right, take your pig, lady. Disgusting, vile little woman. Why did you bring that little piglet all the way here just for me? Or no, it's Morva. Why? Did you bring that little piglet? Okay, yeah, we, we got it. Oh, thank you, thank you so much. I've been thinking of getting a pet pig for a while now. The boys will be so happy when they get home, you sweetie. I'm just, mm. Don't mind me just here to spread my vegan propaganda. Um, yeah, red rupee, 20 rupees. Was it worth it? I don't know. <laughs> Why this little darling is cute as a button. You know, it's so cute that I wouldn't mind having even more of them. Yeah, I bet. I'll do it anyways, because I'm stupid and want the money. <laughs> and you guys need the, the experience. Let's, let's get this one too. Right, sneaking. That's a thing. Take the pig. Pick it up. There we go. Oh, amazing! 
I just stole that pig right from under his nose. He don't even know. He's still crouching over there. The series is probably gonna have a whole lot of tomfoolery. I will probably spend half my time running around doing stupid business. But, uh, it's fine. That was horrible. Yes, I did bring you another piglet, woman. Just give me the money. Yeah, family member. I'm worried about the future of your children if that's the case. God, look at her! Terrifying! Horrible! Should I keep running around and being stupid? Maybe. Let's throw some pots! What's a Zelda series without throwing pots around? We should probably go get Daryl. Oh god. Enemy spotted. He is on the loose. Alright. I will be avoiding that as much as I can. Disgusting! No! Stay away, you freak! Ugh! One of the worst video game villains right there. Disgusting. I assume Errol's still up here anyway. Yep. Oh. Surrounded by birds. I wish I could just be surrounded by birds all the time. I love birds. I guess it's not really hard to get seagulls around you though, is it? Ah! Boy, big brother! Did grandma make that outfit for you? <laughs> she looks impressed too. But, wow. You look like you'd be way too hot in those clothes. I guess they're pretty neat though. So, anyway, Link. Can you close your eyes and hold out your hand? Just for a second. Okay. I'm going to give you my most treasured belonging. But just for one day! Wow! Thanks! Happy birthday! <laughs> you got the telescope. This is your sister's most precious belonging. Treasure it dearly for one day. Gee, thanks. Alright. Yes, yes, I, I think I know how to play video games sometimes. So, well, do you like it? I'm letting you borrow this special gift just because you're my big brother. Aren't you lucky? Hee hee hee. Like, what am I supposed to do during that? Just awkwardly hee hee hee? I, I don't know. Oh, why don't you try it out right now? Try looking over at our house from here. Okay, I will do that. Let me just, uh, put up that down. Okay. Yes, yes, I will zoom in. Yes, there's a strange bird man. Hello. Oh. All right, the postman looks kind of weird, doesn't he? Can't just say that just because he's a bird man. Well, what? Hello? Oh god, I'm looking. There it is. Hello. Bigger bird man with small blonde lady. That's good. Uh huh. And they've brought friends. Excellent. Pirates. Just what we wanted at our peaceful little village. He's swerving it. He is swerving it. I got bad aim. Until conveniently. <laughs> I feel like he could have avoided that, but sure. All right. Yeah, you'd probably live through that fall. Definitely. <laughs> Link, this is so terrible. That girl fell into the forest. She needs help. She's probably dead. That would probably kill a woman. <laughs> but it's too dangerous for you to go in there without something you can use to defend yourself with. Alright, thanks for, uh, conveniently telling me what to do next. Because I, this, like, how old would I even be? Like, c what? No, not that way. I'm down. Just, just fall. Just fall. <laughs> like, I look like I'm, uh, I look like a toddler. <laughs> Maybe I'm at least 13. I don't know. No, stay away! Stay away! Terrible creature. Vile. Oh god. Those little feet sounds haunt me. Wait, can I buy stuff from Beetle already? I'm gonna look. Cause if I can. I would very much like to control a bird about now. Let's see, let's see. Oh, okay. Well, the pouch could be useful, at least first. We can buy the bird thing. Oh! A customer! Welcome to Beetle's shop ship! I deal in pretty much anything and everything! Do you have anything you don't need? If you do, show it to me! I'll pay top rupees for your junk! Or, do you see anything you'd like to buy? Eh, yeah, just use that to browse. Bait bag. It's quite useful. It's my very last one. You can't buy bait if you don't have a bag like this. I feel like I remember using bait. I don't remember needing it, but... Or I don't remember what you need it for anyways. We'll go ahead and get it. Sure. <laughs> Yeah, plenty of bait! I should probably buy some- <laughs> Thank you! Oh man. I'm going to make a member's card just for you. When you buy lots of things and build up your points, something good will happen to you. Something very good indeed. Okay. <laughs> now you have one point saved up. 
30 points to earn a silver membership. Right then. Yes, I can get one. I can get the Huey pair. I will buy it. Thank you. Like I said, lots of tomfoolery. I'll get back to the actual game in one moment. I guess I'll buy bait. I, I don't remember what it's used for. Obviously to bait things. Yeah, feed the stuff to animals. Oh, I don't have 30 rupees. Never mind. I'll come back for it later. Bye. Yeah, later, dude. He looks so sad. Like, are you okay? <laughs> no, just hold on. Just one moment. Okay, I did need the bag to be able to buy this thing. Good, good. <gasps> yes! Yes! I'm a bird! Do I need to be a bird right now? No, I do not. But am I a bird anyways? Yes, I am. Can we pelt my sister in the head? I don't know. Oh, not, not well enough. We can go to the pirate ship. Oh, <gasps> maybe anyways. I don't know if it'll let us go out that far. Why am I doing this? Oh, I can tell you why, because I'm having a good time. Oh, no. <gasps> right, yeah, this is obviously the content you guys all signed up for. Let's go get a sword. <laughs> I like how he was just, he just goes like this the whole time. A weird sorcery, that. Now, I think to get a sword, we just go in here and talk to Orca? As it was, uh, conveniently suggested to us. Hello? Oh, what is the matter, Link? You have an urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is, from the look on your face, I suspect it is no laughing matter. What say you, Link? Ah, have you come for some serious instruction in the way of the sword? Yes, sir. I have. Let's see if I can remember how to fight. <laughs> I can do a sick backflip at least. <laughs> Very good. Your first lesson shall be the horizontal slice. Face me and press B. Do not fear for my safety. I am ready for you. Okay. Oh, guess just once. Good. Keep coming at me until you hear me say "Very good." All right. Oh, that was not right. <laughs> Just pressing forward. And there we go. Very good. Next is the vertical slice. Hold ZL to target me and then press B. All right, we can do that. Keep swinging! I shall you keep interrupting me. There we go. Very good. Next is the thrust. Target with ZL and then tilt. Tilt elf towards me. Hello, I apparently never learned how to read. Towards me and press B. Come at me. Thrust with your sword! Little forward there, old man, but okay. Very good! Keep thrusting. Next is the spin attack. Hold B briefly to build up your strength, then release it, or rotate L once and press B. Okay, we'll, we'll just hold it. Oh, that was not correct. There we go. Very good. More. Keep it up. I apparently need to back up a bit or I will just hit him. Next is harder. This is a parry attack. Target the ZL until you see A. And then quickly press A to perform a defensive strike right then. Okay, we're kind of backed into a corner here, but I guess it'll work. <laughs> A little awkward, though. Yes, we, we shall do it again. Can we back up? Might be a little bit better. Come on! There we go. Very good. Now finally, the jump attack. Draw your sword, target, and press A. Right. There we go. Come at me once more! Sure, old man. That was a fine display. Well, thank you. And yet, I sense a certain anxiousness in the sword you hold. An eagerness that goes far beyond the mere desire to be wielded on the fields of battle. I do not know what has happened, but I have faith in you. Somehow, I doubt you'll misuse that sword. You may have it, Link. I give it freely. Take the blade with you. Oh, thanks, old man! It got sudden, like, very dark. <laughs> you accepted the hero sword. Wield it with B. Use it wisely and carefully. You don't want to let down the kind old man. No, would, would hate to do that. Since the olden days, the sword has been used to fend off evil. Its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. Be strong, Link. Okay. Oh, another bow. There we go. <laughs> right then, let's head out. And I suppose we'll just make our way up there now. I could talk with the villagers a little bit more, but... I'm just excited! <laughs> no. No! No! Ah! The last pig. I suppose I could take it. I'm also going to get this rupee. 
Yeah, you know what? I'll, I'll take it, because I remember a uh, secret little ruby area that I'd like to go to. Stay away, demon! Take it! Give me your money! Oh, look at this one! You sure don't know where to find the cutest pigs on the whole great sea! Hey, oinker! Oink oink! Oh, now things will be ever so much more lively in the pen. It'll be a big pig jamboree in here! Thank you so much. That's right, I can't lit lit. <laughs> Don't know where I've suddenly acquired a strange accent, but okay. I can't let you leave without giving you a present. Happy birthday, Link. Oh, there we go, another red rupee. I guess I'd better think up some names for these little oinky woinkies, huh? Disgust me. But, real quick, I am just going to crawl down here because I remember there being some rupees down here. And I would very much like to acquire them so that I can continue to uh, mind control seagulls, apparently. <laughs> There we go, orange rupee. A hundred rupees. Excellent. And let's go. I think there might be one under the other house too. But it's fine. We don't need that many rupees. At least there's a part of the game where you go under there. But you guys always get mad at me if I don't find literally every secret hidden treasure ever. I tend to just enjoy running around. I'm a little bit forgetful, you know. I'm just running around having a good time. Mm. Sorry about this trees. That were probably planted there for a reason. And also, would it be a Zelda game if I didn't just chop down all the grass? It's not really giving me anything though, is it? What a disappointment! You failed me, grass! It's getting kinda spooky up here, okay. Let's chop this grass! Oh, some rupees. Excellent. God, I would actually hate this. I hate bridges like this. Much less with a plank missing. But okay, in we go. Ooh. There she is! Somehow conveniently made it! Despite that terrible, terrible fall. Let's see if we can get her down then, shall we? Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, I, I, I saw it. You didn't need to tell me, game. Oh, that's not the right button! <laughs> I think this is a boat goblin? Yes. Perish. Mm, that looks convenient. Like someday I might be able to return and bomb it, perhaps? Oh, hi. <laughs> Where did these even come from? How far were y'all carrying those things? Okay, thanks for that. Really appreciated it. <laughs> ah, oh. Oh god, hi. Yeah, plunging attack. Got him. Okay. <laughs> Rip. And uh, now she's dead. No. Ouch! Hello. Don't mind me in my weird little outfit. <laughs> wow. What's with that get up? Well, whatever. So, where am I? <laughs> oh, that's right. That giant bird came in. Miss! Miss Tetra! What is that? <laughs> Can we just take a moment? Just take a moment to appreciate this. This weird little man. Look at his little stubby legs! They're so small! Oh. Oh, thank- Thank goodness! You're safe! When I saw you- When I saw you get dropped on the summit, I thought for sure you'd- <laughs> Summit? So that bird dropped me on the top of a mountain? Well, that wasn't very nice of it. <laughs> I guess that's one way to say it. Well, don't just stand there. Let's go! Time to repay our debt to that bird in full. <laughs> but, miss, what about this boy? Don't worry about him. Come on. Alright, you're welcome. <laughs> Hi! Hoi! Big brother! <laughs> She's adorable. Oh no. <laughs> and the frickin' birds. And then there's that frickin' bird. <laughs> oh no. And now she's dead. <laughs> Brother! Yeah, what do you want me to do about it? He's flying! Barely I'm gonna attempt- that's real smart. <laughs> Never saw that one coming. 
Ugh, stupid kid. Get a hold of yourself. She's gone. There's nothing you can do. Well, goodbye. <laughs> and the seagulls! Oh, my heart. Okay. And there we have it. What? You want to come with us on our ship? <laughs> this freaking stubby legs. It's getting to me. Do you understand what you're asking? We're pirates. You know? Pirates? The terrors of the seas? What do we get out of bringing some helpless little kid along with us? I'll tell you what we get. A headache. I know how you must feel with your sister being kidnapped and all, but that doesn't really have anything to do with us, no, does it? Actually, it does. It's entirely your fault. <laughs> you brought the bird here! Though I guess you couldn't really help that, but, you know. Still. And how do you figure that? Ah, oh, hello, bird man. Whoa, whoa, whoa there. Just who are you? Where do you get off butting in on someone else's conversation? <laughs> what? Please. All I mean to say is that if you big bad pirates hadn't come to this quiet little land, that poor girl wouldn't have been snatched away by that bird. And just what do you mean by that? Just be quiet for a moment and I'll tell you, this guy is savage! I'm being so annoying today, he's so savage. Now, as my work entails delivering letters, I spend much of my time traveling amongst the many different islands. As a result, I hear many things. Haven't any of you heard word that young girls have been getting kidnapped lately from all regions of the Great Sea? No matter. Whether you've heard it or not, that seems to be the case. Young girls with long ears like yours have been getting kidnapped, never to be seen again. And unless my eyes fail me, the young girl who was just kidnapped from this island also has long ears, does she not? Much like you do, Miss Fearsome Pirate. My point is that the bird mistook that poor girl for you, and that's why it grabbed her. <laughs> and correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was young Link here who saved you from the monsters in the forest, wasn't it? Is this true? Oh, and while I'm at it, <laughs> he's just digging into him, isn't he? I may as well tell you that the bird that kidnapped both of you and Link's sister has made its foul nest to the north on the heights of the Forsaken Fortress, which is immediately going to make me uh, regret playing this game. <laughs> no, but I, I do hate it a lot. The Forsaken Fortress? Isn't that the place where... So, what are you going to do? Under the circumstances, I don't think it would be unreasonable for you to give Link a little help now, would it? Hmm, I don't need you to tell me that. Even if we were to consider it, Lately I've heard nothing but evil rumors about this Forsaken Fortress. You can't possibly mean to go there with nothing but that cheap little sword. That's not brave, it's stupid. I mean, come on. Even a simple little island like this has to have something you could use as a shield. <laughs> I just love how it's bold and everything, like, I think I get it. You know, something to protect yourself with? Anything? Tell you what, if you come back with something like that, we'll let you style away on our ship. Oh, and one more thing. Once we leave, you won't be coming back here for a while. So you better go say goodbye to your family while you still have the chance. I don't want you getting all weepy-eyed and homesick on me. Alright. Now, uh, luckily enough, I do know where a shield is, so... Let's just go ahead and get that. Grandma looks so sad. What is it, Link? Please, tell Grandma what's troubling you. And where's Errol? She's still outside playing with the goals? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I see. All right. Link. Is this what you're looking for? Take it with you. You got the hero's shield! This is the legendary shield said to have been used by the hero himself. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know how to use a shield. I like that he actually does it. I guess it's true. Errol really has been kidnapped, hasn't she? <laughs> what kind of monster could take such a sweet young child? <sighs> Thank you for the sad... Sad clarinets. At least I think they're clarinets. I used to play it, you'd think I would know. Uh, <laughs> don't mind me. <laughs> but yeah, enough sappy sad music! We're going on an adventure! 
But I think that is actually where I'm going to leave off this first episode. I am so excited to play more. I know I probably... What, what are you doing there, Link? <laughs> I know I probably didn't need another um, series on my channel. But I just really wanted to start playing through Zelda 2, you know? I just love it. And I'm hoping to upload more consistently. We'll see how that goes. But I'm starting to try to like shift to doing YouTube more than I work on art. So don't forget to leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it and are excited for the series. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.